Hey everyone and welcome to part 15 of Russian Clank, Future Tools of Destruction. So, last time we made it here to the Iris Supercomputer Comet. What, the Kreeble Comet or something like that? But now we gotta deal with these pirates and trust me, they are not welcoming us with uh, open arms. And I, that's the... Okay, why is it that I cannot... Finally, I cannot hit that guy. Do not know why, but it was an issue the entire time. No, and I did not use that. Darn it. Nano swarmers, go. I guess we could heal via the vendor. I guess that's always a way to do things. Here, I'll take down these shield baron pirates. Perfect. And we got max nano, or got a nanotech upgrade, so everything was destroyed around us and the such. Okay. Once again, nano swarmers. Perfect for taking down the guys in the turrets. And then we'll try out our pyro blaster. Kind of reminds me of like the pyrocitor in the original Raichen Clank, but slightly better. Okay, now this guy. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Great, okay, no, there he is. Let go. So... Let's, let's upgrade our buzz blades. There we go. V4. Perfect. Now we can open up the bridge. Without any worries of enemies coming. Though we do have to fight a boss over here. It's another one of those mini bosses that kind of shoots the big cannonballs at you that bounce around or explode. In this case he does both. And this time we have four alpha disruptors so that'll help us. Yeah see? Shoots up cannonballs. Good thing is the alpha disruptor does disrupt his movement too. And it does more when it's fully charged as well. And that swarm is level up so darn slowly. And they actually don't do that much to this guy either. And there we go, he's dead. So he falls to his doom. Anything we can use to get across? There goes our way across. There must be another way around. Oh, I bet you I know what it is. In the last episode when I said the geo laser, I was lying. We do use the geo laser here. This is a really weird one. Like, why do you need to cut some so much of it? Can you just cut the top of it? And what was that? The box knocked me down into the cliff. And that wasn't a checkpoint either? Oh my lord gosh almighty. Guys, this is gonna be annoying. This is, I believe, the hardest part of the actual game. Which is saying something. I think it's just because of what we actually have here. And looks like we got more of you guys again. I might speed this part up depending on how long it takes us to do anything else in this episode. Hey you. Oh Jesus. And what do you want? Okay, you're dead. So let's go back and get full ammo and full health. That'll certainly come in handy. And I always forget that I have the charge boots. Okay, leave. I don't know why my Wait, why are there more of you all of a sudden? There wasn't this many shield guys last time. Why did you guys respawn? It's like this weapon can't even upgrade, so using it is kind of annoying. Okay, now these guys, remember our tip? Nano swarmers. If you actually attack the right enemy, that is, though. I guess we could always try out our new... No. Okay, you're dead. Perfect for us. Do I have to actually defeat the boss over again, though? Okay, now I know the guy's gonna come out. Yep, see, he comes out as soon as we do that. And he's dead. It was not difficult in the slightest at all. Now you just have to defeat big burly pirate majigger over there again. Okay. Don't know why the camera angle changed like that for a second. I guess Alpha Disruptor can be found in there. 
I be mistaken, me hearties. Wait, we're meant to destroy that so I can get some more ammo. Oh, wait a minute. No, we don't actually have to fight him. What? Then why bring us all the way back? And you know what, boxes? You killed me last time. Okay, what else is there? Is there any turrets? No, just guys with guns, apparently. There we go. Destroyed. Okay, now where do we go? Okay, we can go that way. I uh, just gotta look for the one bolt there is here. Like, out of this entire huge area, there's only one bolt to find. Which is kind of weird. I smell someone doing laundry. Wow, weapon vendor. Nice. Hey, I hear uh, Slag and, um, what's his name? Can't quite remember his name. I hate these enemies though. Oh, he's stuck, so we can just use that to our advantage. And there we go, V5 on the Shard Reaper. Congratulations, you have upgraded to the Nitro Reaper. This Ooh, the Nitro Reaper. will temporarily freeze your enemies as it deals damage. Oh, it freezes enemies. Well, that's going to come in handy. Whoa, don't want to fall off the ledge. Arrrr. Go figure, dude. You're a pirate. You always go, arr. There we go. The guy in the turret's destroyed, so we'll just destroy the guy at the blaster. Oh, God, there's two guys with blasters. That's kind of terrifying, actually. And see, we almost have all our money back after buying the uh, the Pyro Blaster. Oh, and we apparently have to do this. So, let's open up this door. Hmm. You look like a pirate, but can you dance the jig like one? I'm pretty sure. To your left. To the sky. To your right. To the sky. To your left. To the sky. Shake your booty. To the sky. To the sky! Shake your booty! Yeah, I like shaking my booty. Thank you. Okay, yeah, we made it. Thank you very much. Um, actually, I don't... Other than... I don't know why I'm not using you. Oh, maybe because we gotta fight him, apparently, now. And he's in a very tight doorway, which actually makes him pretty easy to fight. Except for that time, I misjudged where his cannonball was going. Oh, I was hoping we would have enough to level it up, but no, we don't. Why can't I hurt him? He can hurt me, but I can't hurt him. Ah, uh, he's immune to my weapon, apparently? That's that's full. Okay, that, that's, I hope that doesn't kill me. So that one does, though. Like, we have 71 HP and we still die like crazy. Okay, good. We don't have to go all the way back. Though we do have to fight this guy again. Hopefully we can get him stuck. And eh, he's not stuck, but we can still kill him. Eh, easy. Like, this weapon's almost V5 as well. I believe that's why, like... I hate how it's so delayed to actually leave the, uh... uh Freaking, um, whatchamacallit? Uh, weapons vendor. Oh, this does major damage now, even though I believe it's my weakest damage weapon. Oh, I gotta sneeze. Please don't sneeze. Darn, I always get hit by that guy. I believe every time I play. Eh, yeah, we got health, though. And you're dead. And more health. Thank you. The good news is we don't have to open up the door again. So, like, defeating bosses and opening doors saves, but not where you died. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna try this again. And can I actually use you this time? Okay, I can. I can't see what I'm doing, though. And there we go, he's dead. Yeah, we did it! Hey, there's the supercomputer! We made it in. So this is the Iris supercomputer. How do you turn this thing on? It appears to have been damaged by space pirates. Perhaps I can repair its CPU. 
Oh, looks like we got a Clank mission. Send Clank into the Iris. Oh. This type of level again. Remember your training, sire. Oh, hey, look, Zony. Hey, little Zony. Okay, perfect. Now we can just go across all this electrified stuff. Looks like we do need to get some zonies, though. Is it zonies or zony is plural Zony. as well? Eh, who cares? They're just little robots that help out Clank. Use, our Use the charge up. Energize. Energize. Can I? Can I go? Thank you. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait, yeah, you guys attack automatically. Let me see the gadget bots. Wow, they're not any... It's weird, though. I don't believe... Does Clank actually get his... Okay, he does get his little... Uh... Ooh, more Zony. Got a lot of Zony here. And charge up my minions. Do they... Do you lose them, or do they come with you? Oh, I believe that actually uses up their life force. Well, that's not very good. Okay, we'll just do that to prevent, you know, okay. Oh, that's a little, there we go. Now we'll kill off these pirates. I like how they only do one damage to Clank, though, yet to... To ratchet, they do way more. I uh, believe levitation will be the way, yeah, to get up to these guys. And then we'll levitate over here. This is just a bunch of lever levitation. Levitation. Yes, levitation sounds like the way to go. Oh, more electrified panels. Did you just shoot my zony? You're not very nice. There we go. And yes, your time ability does wear off. I believe it does. I'm not actually quite sure now. Uh, oh yeah, you guys gotta use your charge ability here. It's funny how these ow, they say energize, but yet they yet they use a charge ability. And those two pirates just walked off the ledge. Yeah, yeah, you, you you dare use that attack on me. And ow, I stepped on the electricity. Go figure. Okay. Okay, let's just not get electrocuted. And that Zony's head just appeared out of nowhere. And did we make it? Hmm, a fractured vector shell. Uh, oh. Perhaps there is a way to repair it. Yes, yes. Do I really? You have to really come over here to do it. Yes, Zony's fix. Okay, apparently I was in that Zony's way. I believe we activated the computer. How does it work? Existence is divided into infinite dimensions. The Dimensionator opens a portal to these worlds. The Lombax has constructed a device in order to exile the Kragmites. Then how did Tachyon survive? Percival Tachyon, discovered by Lombax trillion miners eons after the war, frozen in an egg on this very planet, and raised on Fastum. Wait, 
Tachyon was raised by Lombaxes? Affirmative. But when he learned of his true origins, he set out to bring back the Kragmites. So where's the Dimensionator now? An explorer named Max Apogee relocated it to Kershaw City. Our cells function at 8% capacity. 8% capacity. No, wait! Where did the Lombaxes go? Why did they leave me behind? Thank you for visiting Iris. Please do not forget to validate. We need to get to Kirchhoff City. If we can get our hands on the Dimensionator... A wormhole device is too dangerous for anyone to possess. Now please, the zombies say Talwin is in trouble. We need to get to Zordul. You know, Clank, just once, I wish you'd listen to your real friends instead of your imaginary ones. Mm, yeah, because Clank can't see it. I got we get Zordoom Prison, but we don't get Kirchhoff City. And let's see. Well, we'll I guess we'll fly to Kirchhoff City, and apparently it's saving when we hop into our ship. So, Planet Planet Visceron, Zordoom Prison. Okay, let's go to the prison. <laughs> Here we go. Zordum Prison, Planet Visceron. Or Viceron, I'm assuming it's Visceron. Ratchet, please understand. The Dimensionator must be destroyed. Why? Because your imaginary friends told you so? Ratchet? Clank? Did I call it a bad time? No. The timing was perfect, Quark. Did you get the holographic schematics of Zordum we asked for? No need for holographs, Ratchet. I happen to be a skilled schematic artist, trained in the prestigious Kurwan Learning Annex. Behold! Zord Doom Prison, a dangerous dungeon of dastardly denizens, death and destruction. A deadly den of devious desperados damaged by decades of... Uh, uh, let's just say the criminals. To infiltrate this fortified fortress of fear, our agent, codenamed Dead Meat, will make his way along the grind rail of certain death, traverse the walkway of tortured souls, and ascend the grav ramp into the mouth of the Jolly Jackal. While I direct the operation from my townhouse of solitude, our agent will jump down the elevator shaft to the lair of eternal sorrow. It is here he will be confronted by an army of Tachyon troopers, a battalion of embattled bandits, and an entire school of zombie ninja panda bears. Good luck, dead meat. May you die a glorious hero's death. That's unstarable. Oh, wait. We're not even out of our ship yet. Okay. Um, I don't know. I believe we'll probably do this in the next episode. But, oh, hang on, guys. We gotta deal with these little wusses. And there we go, V4. Didn't even mean to upgrade it to V4, but it worked. Anyways, we'll just collect all this. And we got some Alpha Disruptor ammo. Which means we can save money when it comes to buying ammo. And do we have anything new? We have the Negotiator. Blow your opponents to smithereens with the final... Word and rocket propelled incendiary devices. So we'll pick it up. And then we'll upgrade. How about our buzz blades? Uh, max up this damage. Get that. We're just missing it. Anyways, guys, in the next episode, we will continue on and do Zordoom Prison.